welcome to sip9.com. In this video, I tutorial natin yating series on cancellation, no? Pangalawa nito sa video natin, and uh, from the previous from the previous video, ay uh, pinagaralan natin kung paano ba gamitin yung cancellation para mas mapadali yung ating computations, no? So sa previous video, ang pinagaralan natin is uh, uh, how to use cal cancellation in uh, um, reducing fractions to lowest terms and also in uh, multiplying fractions. Dito may konting ano tayo, no, dagdag. So, dun sa previous video, ang, pwede, ang ginawa lang natin is uh, multiplication of fractions by fractions. Dito sa next example ko ay pwede rin pala natin gamitin yung cancellation pag nag-multiply tayo ng whole number tsaka fractions. So, for example, meron tayong uh, 4 times 3 halves, for example. No? So, dito ang 4 means 4 over 1, di ba? Sabi natin, pwede na tayo maglagay ng 1. Kasi 4 over 1 is the same as 4. So, meron na tayong fractions. Sabi natin, pwede tayo mag-cancel if we have uh, a number on the numerator and the denominator. Dapat pair yan, ano? Pag nag-cancel tayo. Hindi pwedeng parehong numerator or parehong denominator. So here, ang pwede natin i-cancel is yung 4 tsaka 2, no? Yung isa na sa numerator, yung isa na sa denominator ng fraction. So kahit hindi parehong, kahit wala sa dun sa fraction, no? basta pair ng numerator at denominator sa multiplication, pwede natin siyang gawin, no? So, both numbers are divisible by 2. 2 divided by 2 is 1. And then 4 divided by 2 is 2. So, mangyari is magiging 2 over 1 times 3 over 1, which is the same as 2 over 1 is 2, and then uh, times 3 over 1 is also 3, which is equal to 6. Okay? So, number 2, we have... Hindi naman natin, yung number 2, hindi na fraction, no? Ang gagamitin natin dito is... Uh, well, I think it's still fraction, uh, Rational expressions nga lang siya. So, may part lang siya na fraction. For example, we have 12m uh, cube, cubed m to the fourth over 4m and cubed. So, dapat medyo, yung example na to, marunong na kayo dapat mag-algebra, no? Kung hindi nyo alam kung paano to, ang um, yung sa loss of exponent, pwede nyong tignan yung ating series on loss of exponent. So here, 12 tsaka 4, pwede siya i-cancel out, di ba? Magiging, ang um, 12 tsaka 4 are both divisible by 4. So, 12 divided by 4 is 3, and then 4 divided by 4 is 1. Okay? Dito sa m cubed tsaka m, yung ilalim ang m cubes, ibig sabihin yan m times m times m, tapos meron tayo isang m sa baba. So, pwede rin tayo mag-cancel, no? m at saka m. Baka magkamali kayo, gagawin yung 0, no? So, dinivide yung siya sa m. So, m divided by m is 1, and then m if divided by m is also 1. So, ang matitira na lang, m times m times 1 over 1. So, yung 1 na yan, okay lang naman yan. Bari, wala na siya. So, m times m times 1, m squared na lang. So, dito, 3 over 1, meron tayong 3 na natira. And then m cubed over m is m squared. And then yung n to the 4th over n cubed. So n times n times n times n over n cubed. Which is n times n times n. So magka-cancel out yan, no? yung mga yan. So puro, puro sila divisible by n, magiging 1 sila. n times 1 times 1 times 1 is n equal to n, and then n over 1, 1 times 1 times 1 is 1, is also n, no? n over 1 is n. So, ito yung pinakasagot natin, no? So, kung makikita nyo, ginagamit natin yung cancellation, hindi lang sa numbers, kundi pati rin sa mga uh, algebraic expressions na yung kanilang uh, mga terms ay mga letters, no? Okay, number 3, last example, Ginagamit din yung cancellation pagdating ng uh, mga equations. No? For example, 3 over 4x plus 
12 equals, oh sorry, plus 2 third equals 8. No. So para matanggal tong denominator natin, multiply natin everything by the uh, least common multiple of 4 and 6, or oh, sorry, 4 and 3. At napag-aaral natin before that uh, pwede na natin i-multiply yan, no? Yung isa sa mga strategies, pag hindi sila relatively prime, pwede natin i-multiply na lang. So, kung hindi nyo alam po paano kukunin, yung standard na method ay meron tayong video niyan on how to get a least common multiple of 2 or more numbers. So, ang common multiple niya ay 12, so we multiply everything by 12 para matagal yung fractions. Sorry kamapagkamalan ito exponent. So, lalagay natin dito 12. And then, also here, we have 12. And lastly, we have 12. So, magiging 12 times 3 fourths. Magiging, pwede tayo mag-cancel dito. 12 is divisible by 4. So, and 4 is divisible by 4. So, magiging 4 of 4 divided by 4 is 1, and 12 divided by 4 is 3. So, kung mapapansin nyo, uh, magiging, ang sagot nito, magiging whole number na siya, di ba? Kasi 3 times 3 is 9. 9 over 1 is 9. So, magiging 9x na yan. Plus, also here, 12 times 3, divisible sila by 3. So, 3 divided by 3 is 1, and then 12 divided by 3 is 4. So, magiging 8 na ito kasi 4 times 2 divided by 1. So, this is also 8. Equals, 8 times 12 is 96. So, nawala na yung ating, uh, um, tawag dito, nawala na yung ating fractions and we used cancellation para mas madali yung ating uh, pagsisimplify ng ating equation. So, hindi ko na ito solve na kasi, kasi hindi naman about equation yung ating lesson. Of course, you can solve if you want. Pero ang lesson natin dito is on cancellation. So, nagawa na natin siya. Naging simple na yung ating uh, equation. So, yeah. Uh, kung magkatapos na tayo. Of course, kung nire-require ng inyong uh, problem or yung task na yun, nire-require na isolve nyo, of course, you have to solve this. Pero ang pinapakita natin dito, o, paano nakakatulong yung cancellation sa pag-simplify uh, ng ating computations. Okay, maraming salamat. I hope nag-enjoy kayo. Uh, gusto kayong imbitahin sa sipnayan.com. Nandiyan yung ating uh, uh, list ng videos. And uh, uh, pwede yung tignan, no? no? At uh, pwede yung panoorin ng sunod-sunod. Mas maintindihan yung mathematics. Okay, gusto ko rin kayo imbitahan sa ating YouTube channel. But kung kayo nananood uh, sa YouTube, tignan nyo lang yung uh, subscribe button below, no? Yung ating video. And you can subscribe from our uh, videos. Okay, maraming salamat and I hope uh, meron kayong tutunan. See you in the next tutorial.